All right, I just pulled off the leaf lard. This is what uh, Crisco is made to uh, imitate. The next thing that I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull off the tenderloin. So that's, this, if you ever had a T-bone or a porterhouse, it's that small side of either, either of those. And it runs right out of the inside of the spinal column. All right, next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut the flank off the ham. So we get as long a belly as possible. Now I'm gonna saw through uh, this, just in front of the sirloin bone so I can separate the ham and the sirloin. The sirloin is this part right here from the rest. Now we're gonna separate uh, the shoulder made up of the picnic, which is from here to here and the top butt from the loin and the belly. One, two, three, four, five. Counting down five ribs, so I'm cutting between the fifth and sixth rib. And now I'm going to separate the loin, so this is all pork chops from the belly over here. Just making two marks on either of the end. Just sort of playing connect the dots. Sawing through the spare ribs. These up here are the baby backs. These are the spare ribs down here. If you take these and cut them square, you end up with St. Louis style ribs, just in case anybody's from the Lou and they're proud. All right, last thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take the spare ribs off. square them up into St. Louis style. And that's it. There's our bacon.